Reverend, is it tough to keep the rhythm going when you're in a game like that and there's a lot of penalties to kill? Yeah, there's a momentum kind of slows down a bit, but I'm just going to try to work the Just kill those penalties and go back to work. You guys have just passed the halfway point here. Uh, how do you think it's going to look like? Team's really coming together. We've, uh, our offense has really picked up in the uh, last five or so games. And uh, the defense, we just keep trying to do what we can do every night. The whole team is going to help them. Certainly did it tonight with a goal and some uh, great defensive work. Yep, we, uh, we always get up for shoulder. And, uh, being where I grew up, we'll see I get up, which uh, a little more uh, for them, but it's all good. good. Thanks, thanks, River. Well, uh, a lot of penalties in that game, and I know you took note of that. Uh, I know we, we were speaking in the press room prior to the game and uh, practice on Tuesday that our game is flowing well because we're not you know, getting uh, interruptions with penalty kills and stuff like that and all of a sudden this happens uh, and it does disrupt the flow. You can see when we were going five on five that things were smooth and uh, we were getting really solid performances but that's going to happen regardless and uh, I was happy to see us kill off uh, couple of those five on threes, that's difficult. Could have put them right back in the game, so good work for us. I was going to be uh, the other side of the coin I was going to mention. For all the penalties that were called, there was only one power play goal scored by the Huskies. Yep, yeah, we did a great job of uh, keeping them out of the danger zone there. Uh, Mitch Ralston in, in net did a great job. If there was any danger, he snagged it and uh, oh, uh, got the, put a delay in the game. So uh, that, that was difficult and uh, good for us that we got a chance to get out there and practice that. It's not our preference for sure, uh, but that's going to come up every once in a while. But everyone kept it cool and I thought we handled the situation very well. You got Durham coming in tomorrow night, uh, a chance to put some distance between yourselves and them. Yeah, we're looking uh, at this weekend as uh, you know, very important, uh, not only for the points, but just to see how the standings look at the end of the weekend. Uh, we are feeling good about ourselves right now. Uh, we're healthy. Uh, we're getting lots of uh, solid performances from everyone. So tomorrow's going to be a, a good game. We're looking forward to it after getting through that. And uh, yeah, let's see if we can uh, move up the scale and keep the guys behind us. You had a new face in there tonight, uh, Chris King. He looks like he plays with a bit of an edge. Yeah, he's uh, uh, one of those players that you want in the, you know, any, any coach would want in their dressing room. He'll go out and do what, everything that you want. He's great with his, uh, with his linesmen. He's great on the bench and keeps uh, everything real positive out there. And, you know, for his first game in, in quite a while, that was very impressive. Yeah, thanks, Coach. Great.